What's poppin' homies? It's your favorite homegirl gossip girl. So let's talk about the sentencing of Harvey Weinstein, R. Kelly, and that guy that um murdered Nipsey Hussle, which his name is Eric Holder Jr. So let's talk about their sentences. Okay. So Harvey Weinstein, the former Hollywood mogul, already serving a 23-year prison sentence in New York, was sentenced in Los Angeles on Thursday to an additional 16 years in prison for charges of sexual assault and rape. Which is, take the G off, you know what that means. Okay, so that is his sentence. So, he's already old. He's already old. I don't even know how long this man going to last in jail. Okay. Weinstein, who was 70 years old, was convicted in Los Angeles in the Los Angeles case in December, three years after he was convicted at a sex crimes trial in New York City. Weinstein's new sentence will run consecutive with the 23-year term given to him in his New York trial, giving him a total of 39 years behind bars in sex crimes convictions. Hmm. In the Los Angeles case, a jury found Weinstein guilty of three counts related to the accuser known as Jane Doe 1, forcible, oral, and penetration by foreign objects. Mm -mm -mm. The jury found him not guilty of sexual battery by restraint involving a second accuser identified as Jane Doe 2 and was unable to reach verdicts for allegations involving Jane Doe 3 and Jane Doe 4. My goodness. Well, he's in jail for a total of 39 years. He is not getting out. And from the looks of how he looks <laughs> and his age, he probably will pass away before his he do half of his sentence. Okay. So that is with that. Now let's move on to R. Kelly's sentence. Do, 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 do. So, R. Kelly, already serving 30 years for sex trafficking, sentenced to 20 years in federal child porn case. Hmm. R&B singer R. Kelly was sentenced to 20 years in prison in a Chicago federal courtroom on Thursday following his conviction last year on charges of child pornography and enticement of a minor, his second such lengthy sentence in the past year. R. Kelly, who is 56 years old, is already serving a 30-year prison term for his 2021 conviction on racketeering and sex trafficking charges in a New York federal court. Now, the U.S. District Judge Harry D. Leinenweber said in court on Thursday that 19 years of the 20-year prison sentence will be served concurrently or at the same time as his other sentence. One year will be served consecutively or after the sentence is complete, he said. Now, R. Kelly was convicted in September on three counts of production of child pornography and three counts. Oh, Lord, have mercy on these people out here. Sorry, I lost my... Okay, three counts of enticement of a minor to engage in criminal sexual activity. A motion for a new trial was denied last week. Prior to the sentence, attorney Christopher Brown read from a statement given by one of R. Kelly victims, identified as Jane. I lost my dignity my dignity due to R. Kelly. I have lost my dreams due to Robert Kelly. I have lost my teenage years due to Robert Kelly. She wrote that Kelly was abusive and dominating and made her suicidal. Okay. 
I will forever be the girl that R. Kelly peed on, Jane said through the attorney, referencing the infamous sex tape video shown during his trial, which showed Kelly urinating on his victim. Yes, I I remember that. Oh, disgusting. Disgusting. But anyway, so that is with R. Kelly. Okay. All right. Now we are on to Eric Holder. Eric Holder Jr. was convicted of fatally shooting rapper Nipsey Hussle in 2019. And he has been sentenced to 60 years to life in prison. Okay? 60 years to life in prison. Mm. Los Angeles County Superior Court Judge H. Clay Jack sentenced Eric Holder to 25 years to life in state prison for murdering Hustle and an additional 25 years to life based on a sentencing enhancement because he used a gun. Holder must serve an additional 10 years in prison on assault convictions for shooting two other men who were hustled, who were with Hustle the day of the killing. Eric Holder is 33 years old. He was on a date with a woman who will become his unwittingly getaway driver. Now, I don't know who put unwittingly willingly getaway driver here, but maybe she didn't know. So maybe unwillingly getaway driver would have been much better. Or she didn't know she was going to be a getaway driver. On March 31st, 2019, when he approached Nipsey Hussle in front of the Marathon Clothing Store near Slauson Avenue in Crenshaw Boulevard. So, yeah. So, those are the sentence for those three people. R. Kelly, Eric Holder, and Harvey Weinstein. Now, you already know that if Jeffrey, you know, Epstein was alive, he would have been amongst these people as well. But they already took care of him. Now, has anybody heard about that little black book? I heard that they were supposed to be um, releasing some names. I would love to know. And I know there's some people in there with money and some powerful people in that black book. I would love to know who's in that book. I think we should, we have a right to know who's in that book. I would love to know who's in that book. Mm. These men are horrible. You know, I just don't understand the thing that these guys do these days. You know what I'm saying? Like, why? Why? But anyway, that's all I have for right now. I will talk to you guys later on. If not today, tomorrow. All right, so you guys have a good one. And if anything else come up, like I said, it may not be tonight that I come back and post. But I will post tomorrow when I get off of work. You guys have a good one.